Hello everybody, uh, this is Marty from Little Gadget Reviews or Lil Gadget Reviews. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Pulse Oximeter Fingertip, the Blood Oxygen Saturation Monitor with Fast Accurate, Fast SPO2 Reading Oxygen Meter, Oxygen Monitor with Lanyard and Batteries and it's in black. I will leave a code and a link to purchase this if, if this is of interest uh, but this is something that i've been using for about four months now um, and it's a really nifty little gadget to use when you need it so let me show you how it all works so it's a little gadget that you place onto your finger like so uh, any finger you then would press the little button which is displayed right here and then click it. I'm not sure if it shows in the light, there you go. So then the numbers will start calculating. And I know on this screen you can see flickering, but it's actually not flickering. I think that's the effects of my camera um, and the light on it, but it's not actually flickering. Yeah, so what so what it actually says is 96 and 76. So you've got the percentage SBO2 there that reads your oxygen levels. And then you've got your beats per minute, which is how fast your heartbeat is going. And I've actually compared this with doctors, uh, oximeters, which are considerably more expensive when I've gone in. And the results are practically the same. So it's pretty reliable. Uh, it's powered, let me open it up, by two little batteries and I believe, are these triple A? Yeah, these are triple A batteries. Um, you just slot them in just like that and then you slide this over and then on. It's got a little reading there which uh, tells you the battery life. I've had this for I think four months or just under and I've yet, it's not gone down on a bar yet. Uh, can we see it? No, okay. I'm just trying to try and get that flickering for you, but it's, uh, it's just an effect by the camera. It turns off automatically, so uh, once your finger's out of it and you've not clicked this button, I'll say about 10 to 15 seconds and it turns off. Um, to give you an idea of size, I'll compare it next to my mouse, or I've got a pen here as well, so you can compare it. Let me just, there we go, okay. So it's not too chunky. I'll turn it on the side for you so you can see. And it all, it fits in your pocket. It leaves a little bit of a lump, but not much at all. But overall, it's a really nifty device. Thank you for watching this review. I hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you next time.